Hello everyone, Alchemic Guru here. Welcome back to South Park, the Fractured Butthole. Let's see, we are... Um... Um... I, I guess... Well, I gotta do that thing with Clyde's house. Not Scout John, never mind. Um... God, what do I do? Coon, where are you? Right, oh, there you are. It's time for us to get the information we need from Classy. Any good superhero should know how to interrogate. Get over to Jimmy's house and find out what she knows. Oh, cool, I get to interrogate Classy. How's that gonna go? Well, hopefully she's willing to talk. Hey, Classy. Oh, it's you again. Sup, hero? Don't be farting in my face and shit. Hey, fast pass. One of your super homies is here. I won't fart in no oh, one's face unless I have to. to I'm a hero so after all. Have at it. So, uh. Go ahead, new kid. Ask her anything you want. Yeah, dude, I don't talk. Why does like that never oh, work with you smart. people? Using the silent treatment can really make a witness a antsy. I right, look, I know y'all need my help and shit, but I ain't talking to you. Go get my medication. Y your medication? Yeah, I can't think straight without my medication. You gotta go pick up my prescription, all right? Until you get my prescription, I ain't telling you little heroes fuck all nothing. Okay, pick up her right, prescription. Looks like you got more um. But before you go back out in the world, I want to show you something that might help your crime. Does South Park even have a pharmacy? Huh. This is All right, interesting. Kid, you made a mobile. Your superpowers to the next level. Go ahead and stand in the DNA fibulator. DNA fibulator. All right, new kid, just stand still and I'll talk you through this. Um, yeah, sure, let's go. Let's roll with this. Cuz this doesn't make DNA. I could fuck with my DNA. <laughs> oh, that sounds fun. Check out the new hero DNA slide I opened up for you. Step oh, you it's another thing, just uh, like my uh, artifacts. Combat, uh, effectiveness. that best suits your power loadout. Just keep in mind that a big damage boost may mean less health, or vice versa. Kind of like how steroids shrink your buffs. Or so I've read. This one? Well, alright. Now you know what real power feels like. Pretty dang good. That should do it, new kid. Hope you have a grasp of it. Now get out there and kick some... Booty. Okay, I'll go and kick some ass, I guess. But not before making Bruno, a quick stop with Kyle. Because this episode is going to have me running around a lot. Seriously, God. That, this is one thing that I liked more about Stick of Truth. There was a little bit more of a finite on. line, like a linear path. This one feels like I can go about I this did. these missions. Oh, fuck. Really? You? Will you deal with him, please? Look, Cousin Kyle, it's that mean kid who beat me up before. Yeah, oh no. Somebody stop him. Don't worry, Cousin Kyle. I have developed these super sensors which will make it almost impossible for him to beat us up this time. I have to stay out of this. Just please, please make him go away. Prepare to meet your doom, evil bully kid. Okay, so He's Captain Diabetes, Super Craig, and the Coon. I'm pretty sure the Coon would love to beat up a Jewish kid. That makes perfect sense. But yeah, this this game, the, the biggest thing I'm having against it is there's no linear path. It's like it looks it look it feels more like complete main and some side quest in any real order. To get to your end oh, result, geez, I didn't think which I, you. I do and I don't like it because <laughs> it makes recording a little bit more of a pain in the ass because I don't know exactly what I can and can, what I should or should not cut out. 
Like this, for example, I don't know when I should have had this. Should I have folk should I have put the class taking care of class's prescription before anything? Like it goes into awkward categories like this. But it's not like it's a bad thing. I mean, it's it's more like I'm following along the hero's journey. So, like, while I'm taking care of what the primary thing. So, the primary thing seems to be, right now, get Classy's medication. And she's a hooker, so probably a lot of hardcore drugs. Oh, wait, if there's drugs, that means Towley might be involved. Oh, I hope he's actually in the game and not just your fucking gaming guy. That was, that was kind of a stupid thing. That, that's my only regret buying this for the gold edition. Because it's not because all because any other uh, DLC I've been getting is just like armor and stuff. Like it's not bad, but well, it, it, it's more of a cosmetic thing since the armor in this game means literally nothing. Well, I can finally go. Thanks. That's actually one of the reasons. Like at least in Stick of Truth, I you would see me change around my armor a lot based on like what was good for what I did. This one, there's no real point. There really isn't. Don't mess this up, dickbag. Okay. Time to beat the shit out of you, kid. Boom, 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 boom. Boom! God, I am psychotic as fuck. Alright, it's over. You lost, kid. Go home. You guys asked for it. And now Human Kite shall use his Hebrew face to call upon the power of the wind. Hikmeo Shigina. Uh, Let what? the strength of the wind make my kite fly and I'll take it to him off. Ah, you fucking piece of shit. Ah, don't worry, super buddy cousin. Perhaps I no longer have my kite, but I still have my super weapon. What weapon? What do you could possibly... And she's a... These kids are... Oh, you fucking piece of shit. Who's picking on you? Who are you kids? I'll call your mothers right now. Oh, cool. I get to beat up Kyle's mom? Yeah, get him, Aunt Sheila. Um, okay. This is definitely going in a wrong direction, okay, but, uh, you, you know. Cancel your turn so you don't heal yourself, you stupid your fucking piece of... Seriously, of who does that? Who seriously does that? Who gets their ass kicked and has to call in the fucking parents? Seriously, I do not feel bad about this. Like, at all. This might sting. Hey, you better quit it right now! I'm sorry, Kyle, but D Kyle, come on. Shh. They brought it upon themselves. The heck with that? These boys need to lend some manners. Yeah, Sheila. You want to beat up my mom? You're going to have to go through me first. Oh, oh you're so fucking dead. Go nuts, new kid. I'm sorry, lady, but you're in my way. That's my mom, Dick. Kyle. Kyle, we talked a lot of this over, and a lot of this requires me to beat the shit out of your mother. Captain Diabetes, into the fray. It's the only way to stop the problem, or make it gradually worse. I don't know. Here I go. That's actually weird. Usually she just gives you like a fucking talking to. No, she's gonna try to straight up fight us. I mean, yeah, we're a bunch of kids, and I, yeah. Sorry, Kyle. It has to be done. You guys can't find my mom. She's gonna kick your ass. Ugh, Kyle, language. This one's all me. Get in. They should have moved if he didn't want to get all scratched up. I'm sorry, Mrs. Bravlowski. I'm gonna kick your fucking asses all the way to Canada. Uh, that's what you get for picking on my bubby. This ends now. I'm just glad it's over. My hemorrhoids are really talking to me. You okay? Nice going, guys. Kyle, get inside and call the police. We have to get these kids arrested. No, no, mom. No police. This is all my fault. What? Seriously, how Just fucked up is this mother? Then again, at the same time, do you really think calling the police is going to do anything? People, Seriously, have you seen this town? All the damage you've caused. 
I should press charges against your friends. And lug my kites up in a tree. I'm sorry. Please, I'll do anything. You are going to let your cousin play with you from now on. Is that clear? Oh boy, Kylo and Sheila says I get to play with you. Yes, sometimes you can play with us. Yippee! Now get your cousin's Ugh. kite out of that tree. You're not playing anymore until you do. Come on, Shugana. Let's get you some back team. Oh, I hate back team because it gets on my fingers and I get eczema from the lighter cane. God damn it. That well, was just crap. fucking stupid. Oh, well, how the hell do I get the kite down? And, oh? No, no? What? Am I doing something? What the hell do we do now? Oh, I had to switch. That was it. That was a fluke. Mm -hmm. hey. I'm honestly not doing this. This is literally the buttons fucking up. <laughs> there we go. Oh, hey, that's a great idea. All right, let's uh, do some farkor. Let's do it. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Oh, I am not good at flying. I am sorry, Kyle. Let's, let's try that. Let's try that one more time. Boom. Fuck. Oh, come on. That didn't even let me. No big deal. Let's try again. Okay. Uh, third time's the charm. And up. And up. Fuck. Come on. Maybe close your eyes? I don't know. God damn it. I should have better mastery over my ass at this point. And a hop. And a skip. And a hop. And a land. Wow, your ass is full of surprises. Oh, you know it. Probably didn't sound right, but took care of it. Now my mom can stop being pissed at me. I don't know. We kind of beat the shit out of her. Hollywood. Okay, we'll just uh, take care of this. And land. Cool, is this a new buddy ability? I'm going to I think it is, yeah. When you need to Same thing with diabetic rage. Give me a call and we'll farcore up there. Man, I hope I never need to do that in public though. Kind of embarrassing. No, I agree. Farcore is kind of embarrassing. Okay. Now let's see if I can continue on my journey. Oh, for fuck's sake. I just wanted to cut through here to get to the medical fried chicken. Now I'm defeating raisins girls on my own. De Look, ladies. You lost. Get over it. I totally spit in your food, by the way. No, I don't have to give two shits, thanks. They're going down pretty easy. Body lotion smells like strawberries, and now you do too, cutie. Now, who ordered the old-fashioned beating, cold as hell? This is for all the ladies in the world who have to wear new tights. Face my ass. Uh, I don't feel right. I need to check my makeup. Hey guys, are we having fun yet? Okay, I take it back, you girls. Don't know what you're messing with. Hey, wait, wait, fuck! Ah, oh, you have to really claw me. Psycho chicks. I mean, you're about my age. This isn't the fucking mafia, you know. And Habuski. Oh my god, you did not just do that. And then there was only one. Yes. All right. You good? You all good? You you really want to pick a fight with me? Um, wait, what? You really think you're tough shit, don't you? Well, it's time for you to meet someone. Say hi, Rebecca. Oh God. Oh God. Someone's about to get stuffed someplace. Um. Nope, 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 nope. Skipping. I am not going up your ass, lady. 
You messed with the wrong raisin sugar. Get him, girl! Oh my god. Oh my god. What? A thousand people just disliked the picture of me in ballet class on Instagram. I'm totally getting trolled right now. What the F? Heather, why'd you tweet that I was going out with Eric Cartman? I didn't! I'm totally getting trolled right now, too! What the fuck? What the fuck? I just lost all my followers! I have to get to a computer! What the fuck? What the fuck? Um, what just... Oh! Hello, hey, Nancy. Wendy! Don't worry. I'm unfriending their Instagrams exponentially. They won't be back for a while. You gotta be careful playing superhero. You can make a lot of enemies. So... Some boys think girls don't make good superheroes. What do you think? You think girls are just as good a gamers as you boys? Yeah, well, you, I'm pretty sure you just you saved me, even though scares, I could huh? beat the shit out Fine. of them. Look, you've got problems, new kid. Whatever you did last night got a lot of people's attention. Bad people. There's a crime boss who's been calling the shots here in South Park, and now that person is planning to run for office. Whatever you did last night scared him. I'm tracking everyone's Instagrams and Facebooks, and will continue to cross-reference with Tumblr while monitoring Twitter and LinkedIn. If you need information, just know you can rely on Call Girl. Okay, Watch call girl. Oh, call me handsome. That was nice of her. Though I'm pretty sure I could have deep the shit out of him. Um, I'm still grateful because she sounds extremely useful. Because Wendy is always reliable. Wendy's always been reliable. Oh well. Now can I finally go back on my journey? Whoa, whoa. The, the security here is kind of tight. Um. No way. No way. Um, oh, Morgan. Hey, my bad, fart coach. Miners aren't allowed in a place like that. Oh, so I have to rewind time. So if I rewind time, it will do fucking nothing. Of course, you aren't just any miner. What's this? A recipe? Ooh! What does he get? Uh, let's see, something for a chicken. Mm, interesting. No way. Oh, fuck. Fuck you, Cartman! Ah, uh, okay, let's figure this shit out, I guess. Oh, hey, Mosquito! What's up? D do you need help? The vile creatures inside here have stolen my dad's credit card. You must help me rescue it. You know I am no match for their evil powers of seduction. I can't go in there alone. Will you help? Then come on, you go first. Well, given how they tried to ambush me, I would be more than happy to help you beat the shit out of a bunch of innocent girls. That's the kid! That's the kid who beat up Portia uh -huh, that's right. This kid is here to take back my father's credit card, you bucks of thieves! You gave us your dad's credit card when you wanted time in the wrestling pit with us. Not true. I just wanted to leave. Then why did you say, hang on, I'll be right back with my dad's credit card. He won't even know it's gone. No more head games. Give me the card or there's gonna be trouble. That problem here, girls? Oh, there's about to be. Raisins, girls, unite! Well, shit. Let's, uh, switch up my team a little, I think. Uh... Wait a minute. Shit, they're locked. You know, all the other customers are such losers, but you seem totally cool. W wow, really? Absolutely, sweetie. Have you guys met my main squeeze? Don't you dare lay a hand on her. That didn't take long. Order oh, up, kitties. fuck. Taking a blood sample? Nope, you are not getting a turn, Mosquito. Ow. Oh, come on, why'd you skip me? Fuck him up, new kid. This is for your own good. Leave these ladies alone, huh, kid? Quit fathering the girls. That sucks for you, new kid. Oh, I'm up. Okay. Heal up. Hear the wind beneath my mosquito wings. I am out of fuck ticket. Your punches make the blood pool nicely under their skin, Super Craig. Prime for drinking. Well, dude. Damn, that did a lot of damage. I'm gonna whoop you like my mama did my daddy, sweetie. It's 
see if we can get a little health back. That's some nasty shit, dude. You got this. And fork power. Oh my god, everything hurts and I'm dying. That bouncer is definitely going to be the toughest guy. But the ultimates are almost ready. The wind brings it with justice. Human kind is here. Let's keep Kyle in position so he can heal us. Enjoy. Thanks. All right, my turn. I've had it with this shit. Need to be strategic about my wow, ultimates here. Features. Everybody good here? Great. Hey, yes. uh -oh. I learned that one in Nam. <laughs> Don't anyone dare post a pic of me on Instagram right now. So what can I get you? Bug bite. <laughs> you know you don't really need to drink that shit, right? Well, you really need to punch your enemy, Super Craig? Uh, yeah. Alright, then, don't be a Super And Craig. fuck you, Bouncer! That's going to leave some scars. And you don't get a turn. Nice time tinkering, butthole. Feel the wrath of human height. Pew pew. I like our eyes. She's out. Who needs to get punched the most? It's Super Craig to finish her off. Mega Pop Punch! Yeah, I saw that coming. Huh, who to infect? Hmm. Nice work. Now excuse me while I go throw up. You're up, ass blaster. Uh, I'll drink to that. Almost. Back off. Ah. That ought to teach you some manners. That didn't. The fucking raisins girls hit me harder than that. Time to heal up. You're safe with me. Did someone call for a fist in the face? Nothing really strategic with Cla with Craig. The longer we wait, the harder this punch is gonna be. Prepare for the incredibly annoying sound of my buzzing. Real cute, you little shits. New kid, I like the way you punch. That was your last move, boy. You lost. Okay, girls. Wait, fuck. Oh my god, more raisins, girls? Are you kidding me? Okay, heal up. I didn't expect this battle to keep going. I figured just beat the shit out of the bouncer and we'd be done. Great, now I'm dizzy. After we beat you guys up, do you want to buy a raisin calendar? Yes. If I hit Mosquito to break the charm, he'll probably die anyway. Omega Crunch extra. Oh, God, I feel like I ate a giant burrito. I can hardly move. Fucking mosquito! Time for my farts. I need to brush my teeth like right now. I'm gonna sh I can't even think about zingy tingy wings right now. Perfect, get in position, and I will see if I will unleash my thoughts again. I have a sudden urge to fly to the stratosphere and just go nuclear on these pukes. Laser death. Try laser. No. 
Ah, burning. I miss it so well. So glad you guys were here. Hot mess right now. <laughs> they take double. They take gross out damage and that damage. Okay. I love it. Let's heal up Kyle. He's my healer after all. I'm going to keep him active. I need it. I also need better healing items. Buzzing into action. Nope, you get no turn, mosquito. Oh, come on, why'd you skip me? Go nuts, new kid. Super fort powers activate. Uh, I don't feel right. Damn, I gotta keep Kyle alive. Well, she's at least dead. Will healing Will healing mosquito break him from his thing? I I think. This is for all the ladies in the world who have to wear new tights. Loser. My turn. Mega this under uh, If only you put as much effort into your costume as you did that move. Let's do, oh, let's good. I can't control up. him again. So healing him. So doing anything to him. So heals can break him from oh, nice. charms. Or his charms ran out since it had like a three turn thing. Not a bad ultimate. Oh my god, this is literally the worst thing that's happened to anyone ever. Well, I guess it's just you and me now, bitches. Oh wait, I brought a friend. No, oh, who now? Oh god, her again. Alright. Alright, round three, and I get revenge on that fat bitch, thinking she was gonna shove me up her ass. Well, how about a fist up your ass? But first, this smaller one. Uh -oh. ah, that worked. Half kite, half man, all climb fighter. Kite is half. Heal him up. I'm not sorry for what I'm about to do. There's really not much movement with with Super Craig today. Dangerous curbs ahead, boys. Yes, come face mosquito. <laughs> you cuties are such meanies. Oh shit, mosquito's gonna. Nope, you nope. I will save you, mosquito. Turn denied. <laughs> Damn it, she was gonna kill mosquito. Dude, dial it back. Mighty as kite. Please, Kyle, heal people. Thanks for the pick me up, human kite. Let's see what to do with Super Craig. Since we're both bruisers. That was definitely the wrong button. I meant to hit punch. Not in not anger. And you don't even need to break it off and die when you use it. 
Now I'm gonna be smelling puke all day. Spread the itch. Keep her roast out. Now we're playing dirt. You're pissing me off. Ah, you can't do anything. You're such an asshole, sweetie. All right, you're almost dead. Beware, evil, for from the sky comes a kite. Keep everyone alive because human kite might die soon. Yeah, I feel like a spry little pupa again. More love with me, boys. No, oh, she has no no area moves. Only punch moves. All right, let's uh, get some more mosquitoes up in here. See what that does. That's no way to treat a lady. Excuse you. Lasers online. Feeling the breeze in my thorax bristles. Dude, you are trying way too hard. Put this on your coochie grab. Someone's about to get stuffed someplace dark and smelly. I literally eat kids like you from breakfast. You got skipped. Going for blood, guys. Don't try to get rough with me, kid. Sorry, not interested. Who needs to get lasered? Yeah, <laughs> burning hair. I'm not bloodthirsty anymore. Oh, is this my turn already? Okay. Imagine how cool that looks through my compound eyes. Dude, dial it back. God damn it, that chick is durable. I'm gonna eat you up. <laughs> Sorry it didn't work out between us. It's disease spread time. <laughs> Oof. I swear my thorax will burst if I have one more sip. Dude, dial it back. You're really into this superhero stuff, huh, new kid? Time to fly! Now soar! Soar! Oh wait, you can't even fly! Here we go again! Really hoping we can finish this up soon. Suck on this. Ooh. Oh, that was a blow to the ego. Not even a citronella candle will save you now. <laughs> Satisfying. <laughs> Bottoms up, mosquito! I Finally! I feel that was appropriate. Here it is. I like Here ending it with the finisher, actually. Oh, I cool, mosquito's character sheet doesn't mean shit to me, but... Okay, did it. Leveled up. And now, can I finally be done with these fucking raisins, girls? I mean, seriously. I already beat up strippers yesterday. I don't need to beat up underage hookers. Ugh. Okay, let's get the ingredients I need to actually make that taco. Let's see. One of them was, ske was something about Skeeter's roof cheese. So let's farcore our way up there. Ready? And a hop. And a skip. And a fought. 
And land. There's the cheese. This is really high. The last time I was this high, I had sex with a big old black beach towel. That guy doesn't talk at all. Well, fuck you, Simon. Cool. Okay, I got the Skeeter Root Cheese. The next ingredient was... From CD Walk. It was the Super Spicy. Ah. Craft it, new kid. Just like I taught you. Alright, let's craft it. Perfect. Now for phase three. Hello, welcome Except to there is no phase three. What can I, interest I have to take care of this Craig problem. Alright, listen. I have this ex-friend who I hate now and he still has my goddamn laptop. Go get it from him and tell him if he doesn't let you have it, I'm calling the fucking cops. His name is Tweak. You'll probably find him at his parents' coffee house. Get my fucking laptop back for that prick. Okay, this is seriously just Hello, fucked up. I, I probably should have ordered. I, I probably should have put everything together in a much better order. But why am I being the middleman to settle this dispute between these two lovers? How are those taste tests coming, son? Can't even taste the difference anymore. Well, keep sampling. We need to come up with the perfect sunset blend. What's this? There you go. Give me my fucking laptop. Oh, you went for him, huh? <laughs> You can go back and tell him he can have his laptop back when I get my fucking guinea pig back. Huh? We bought it when we were together, but Stripe is mine. Huh? I paid for him, and I have the receipt. You think it's right for him to keep Stripe while he's the one who didn't stand up for me? You tell him that. Oh my god, I'm playing messenger. I don't like playing messenger. I just want to beat people up and fart on them. Is that so wrong? Ugh. Okay, Greg. Here, Greg, oh, here you go. The fucking guinea pig? Uh, fine. You know where Stripe's cage is. Go get him and give him to that fucking asshole. When you give that to Tweak, you make sure... Okay, but before any of that... Let's do this. I really just want to do this. Go on. Don't be shy. Alright. Let's eat the cheesy blah blah blah. Ooh, I can pause time. Nice. Let's pause time. Now I can turn that off. So when time comes back. Aha! Clever. Oh, hey, Coon. I see you've also come to assist in assuring Classy's cooperation. Oh, yeah. Uh, thanks for finally showing up. You know, Please I've been running me. around for probably a couple hours. Uh, hello, we're picking up some medicine for a friend. Oh, is your friend looking for an energizing mental feeling or more of a full body high? Uh, I don't know. Well, I'll send over our expert bud tender who can help you out. Oh, my God, it is Towley! So that's why he was wearing that apron oh, wow, shirt. Towley, thought you went to rehab. Yeah, I did, but now I'm back in South Park. Clean and sober, almost a year. Clean and sober, no drugs at all. And I tell you what, I don't miss it. And you. Okay. Cannabis, Eric, and yeah. Towley sober. Right. I don't trust I that. That sounds pretty unstable. He's he's meant to get high. Pain, migraines and stress naturally. Did you know that ancient Chinese gave cannabis to their infants for teething? Huh. I have an addictive personality, so I'm cool without it. And now I got a kid with my lady, so better to stay on the straight and narrow, you know? You have a kid, right. That turns yeah, out didn't he have a little washcloth once? Too high to realize. Did he get a new now one? I'm holding down a job and paying the rent. But I'm also doing good, helping people find the herbal remedies they need. Y you Call really sound like you're just ready to snap at, like, any Taxes moment. And traffic and a wife breathing down my neck about yep, that's it. The tally, we gotta leave. There's the anger. You fix it. Oh, I'm not a plumber, bitch. I'm a towel, not a fucking plumber. <laughs> okay, we're, we're here to uh, get my friend's medicine. Her name is Classy. Oh, Classy. Yeah, Classy with a Y with the clit hanging off it, coming around and licking the shit out of the sea. No, 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 no. It's uh, Classy with a dick hanging off the eye that's fucking the L out of the ASS. How many Classies oh, are there? Classy. Sure, I got her order. There she is. See, she likes the banana kush for her back pain and some of the platinum OG to wait. What the fuck? Who put the chillax kush in with the OG mellow bliss? What the fuck, you retards? People don't want to mix their mellow with their chill. They'll get all fucked up. Go 
Hey, hey, Tally. Whoa, whoa, calm down. No, it is not fucking cool. I'm trying to run a legitimate business here, and my back hurts. I can't sleep. I got no appetite. The shitty town is so fucked up. We gotta buy all our product from fucking sixth graders. And who knows what the shit they're putting in it. And then to top it off, I got a couple of little dick lickers coming into my store telling me to fucking relax. Fuck you. You relax. You're a town. Oh, I feel so sorry for him. He just wants to get high. Foot tenders, get in here. It's time to give these kids a fucking consultation. Be careful. There's product everywhere. Let's test out this possibility. Said something about I can get free punches. Oh, what the fuck! Infinite health. I can do this all day, cause I'm a super That is terrifying. Our powers are useless against the power. You're gonna wish you were a towel. It's finally my turn. Oh, thank God. Time to try a summons. Got this from helping out right freaking Ned and Jimbo. And somehow it doesn't kill that guy. The guy right in front of them. Even harm them. Oh yeah, go Ned! That's what I'm talking about. Okay, summons aren't bad. Since this probably counts as like a boss fight. So I guess we can use them anytime we want now. Honestly, I wouldn't even try to do damage. I was trying to keep him away. This kind of stuff isn't in the employee manual. Wait, what? Fire. That didn't even do a lot of damage. Light it up, new kid. Hey, this is my life savings in weed here. Ah, hey. Jesus, I seen pussies kick out of that hot fuck. Dude, I don't work out a lot. Make way for King. I'm more of a lover than a fighter. Punch someone for the coon, fart lord. Why serve you right, Todd, you piece of shit? Hmm. You kids take your bad attitude somewhere else. It looks like... Let's see, Tally does just fire, it looks like, but all his attacks are super weak. Who's ready to get maimed? So, what if I'm supposed to do something with that bud that's laying about? Nice try, but I'm a child. Maybe. Flame, shit. Questions for later. That's why I can't take my five minute lunch breaks in peace. I have to do everything around here. Oh. I don't even feel it. I'm a child. Walk it off, butt lord. Let's do this. Let's... You got no turn, Tally. Your turn is now property of Coon and friends. Coon on the plate. minutes for lunch, but you can lay down on the fucking job. This is bullshit. Shit, now you're like Oh, that it. So you Bring can. You have to run over oh, it. Pressure. Burn another pile. Oh shit, I can only burn one pile. Okay, so I don't I'm not going to be on fire much longer. Nope, not on fire anymore. So that's what. Okay. Okay, now I know what I must do. I must run around and set everything on fire. 
That makes sense. I don't need a special objective. I know what I have to do. There we go. Gotta admit it's some quality bud though. We gotta burn another. Can't even catch on fire by doing that. Yes, Tally. Keep lighting me on fire. Welcome to the last day of the rest of your life. Almost. <laughs> I was hoping you'd burn that one too, make it a real party atmosphere in here. Light, light up that last pile. And there we go. Fuck! I'm not on fire. Uh, Tally, what could you come here? Cool? I need to be on. Give no, no, don't go to him. I need to be on fire. Damn it. Okay, Coon, come here. Uh, Coon, need you to stay alive just a little bit longer. So, I guess you're going to be lighting the butt on fire. You guys are fun to hang out with. All right, Coon, let's end the battle by mellowing him the fuck out. I'm burning, I'm burning here. Now for my best attack, my best attack. Hey, guys. Oh, hey, how you been, Eric? Oh, you're a cool guy, man. Oh, Aw, we have normal tally again. Uh, I missed you being all mellow and high. I mean, you fucked up a lot, but, eh, you know what? He was still good. Yeah, this is for Classy. Yeah, I threw in a couple hash nuggets and some granddaddy purple shatter on the house. So come by any time for a hookup. Hmm. Well Alright. Now get that over to Classy. Let's just take care of this Craig business first. Let's see. There he is. Stripe should be. There. Time to freeze time. So, yeah, so certain things had to go in order. I had to. And there we go. Okay. It's just. Bring all this back, I think. Well, since I am nearby, I might as well go back to Classy, take care of that, and then I can go take care of the Tweak and Craig thing. Uh, nope, wrong house. Okay, classy. I got all you got your shit. Prescription? Damn well, better have my prescription. Well, it's about motherfucking time. Praise Jesus, I need this shit bad. If I don't get my medication, I lose my motherfucking mind. You know what I'm saying? I know exactly what you're saying. Even though I don't do drugs, don't do drugs, kids. Unless you live in Colorado, because that shit's legal. <sighs> That's much fucking better. All right, listen. The place y'all niggas need to go is you store it. That's where they taking the cats, you know what I'm saying? That's it. Coon, this is Fefes. The new kid got the intel from Classy. Not bad, new kid. What'd you find out? It's the you store it in the northeast of town. Classy says the cats are being taken there. The you store it. We should have known. All right, keep Classy safe. I'll get back to you guys soon. Roger that. Fast pass. Uh, uh. Fast pass. Uh, uh. Fast pass. Uh, uh, uh. Fast pass. Fast pass. Fast pass out. Looky, looky, if it ain't my little hero. Okay, let's take a pick then. My little hero. Classy ain't a bad person. Classy's fun. Thanks, Classy. Kinda. I'll Don't know. Look at 
This is super Craig. You need to get more of your character sheet filled out. Go over to Crunchy's micro booth. Somebody there can help you. Okay. Well, that's a lot to do. Let's see. Because I still need to take care of that business there. The U store is much later, so that means I have to, uh... Okay, so I just gotta fill out my character sheet a little bit more, because I gotta go there. Okay. God, I so... Oh, hey, God damn it, Mr. Mackey. Uh, I just want to do the story. Why? Fine, back to the school. Great. Just fucking great. What the fuck? Seriously? Oh. So, okay, so it's not in here. There's just six graders and electric fucking water. Looks like your butt can do some crazy shit. Maybe you can use your farts to pause time. Okay, let's just fart to freeze time. Go over there to just... No, oh, I have to... Fuck. Okay, I have to knock it out. See if I can punch him when I'm down. Nope. Oh, I saw that. I saw a shiny. And knocked out. Let's try that freeze time again. There we go. Seriously, why does Mr. Mackey allow this shit in his school? Not even his school, but just allows us in general. It's right outside his goddamn office. All right, what are you talking about? Feedback from the principal that our discussion about sex, I mean about gender, wasn't precise enough. And, well, he gave me some guidelines how to do a more of a thorough pass, helping you identify your gender. Okay. Is the gender that you were assigned with at birth the gender that you currently identify with? Yes. Okay, great. So as you know, that means that you're cisgendered. Okay, great. Now, the next thing I want to talk to you about with your gender is your sexuality. Now, a lot of people think that gender and sexuality are the same, but no, that's bi. That's wrong. It's bi. Okay. Now, how would you describe the sex of the kinds of people you find yourself, uh, sexually attracted to? I'm into girls. Okay, so that makes you straight or heterosexual. Okay. Yes. Sure. I identify. Cool. I'm a heterosexual cisgender, but this is so pointlessly complicated. Just be careful, okay? Because there's there's a lot of people out there who don't accept you for what you are. If this didn't actually contribute to my character sheet, I would have probably just skipped it. God, I'm gonna walk out the school and there's gonna be rednecks. I swear to God. Swear to God. Yeah, yeah, swear to God. Yep, rednecks. Ready to beat up a. I'm a guy who identifies as a guy and I like girls. Why do you think. So, wait, so you're against that? What, what are you people into? I mean, no matter what I, what I chose, they would have beat the shit out of me, but at least this doesn't make sense. You people are a bunch of white heterosexuals. Why are you beating up another white heterosexual? That's not your MO. You just want to beat people up because you're a bunch of fucking rednecks. I don't like the good rednecks. I mean, there are some very nice people that are rednecks. These are like the stereotypical fuck you rednecks. You're not going to know what hit you, but it was definitely the king. Let's uh, get some real rednecks to help me out. It's coming right for us. That's what I'm talking about. Nice. Oh, we didn't win. Talk about half their half their health down. Sounds not bad. Read the Constitution. You'd understand it's my patriotic duty to fuck you up. Yeah. Great. You confused them. I'm big. It's gonna be like. Man. 
It's gonna be like Pokemon, where confusing them fucks up, and... Uh, Aw, man. Really? I might need a do-over. Next time I'll show you what I really meant to do. This is gonna be like the car thing, like, you're just gonna show up and fuck with everything? Because it, it looked more like you just skipped my turn. Skipping your turn. <laughs> you got screwed. Behold the true power of Gaia Bee. It's going to flow through me. Oh, human kite is awaiting more favorable wind patterns. No god, they're confused, so they don't know what to do. Oh, I'm up? Okay. Kite's got your back! Sweet, thanks! Yeah! That settles it. Beating you kids up was definitely the right decision. Coon on the prowl. Bleeding ah, out. What a way to go. Yeehaw! There. Their attack only fuel my rage. Give him hell, douchebag! Oh yeah, take that bitch! Thank God the AI for confusion is pretty damn stupid. Okay. Let's just settle this shit with Craig. When you give that to Tweak, you make sure he knows that when you walk out on someone, you don't get to make up the rules anymore. And look, if you two were even close Hello, to mature individuals, to you'd be settling this what shit together, not force a third party. Listen, I see you're really trying hard to get my son and his boyfriend back together, and, well, I so appreciate it. Having a gay son is really good for the coffee business. I think all they need is a little relationship counseling. Could you give this to Craig? Maybe together we can both help them out, huh? Counseling? Seriously? Ugh, fine. I'll help them out. Here. Counseling. Read this. Tweak wants me to go to counseling with him? No way. Tell him there's no way I'll go to counseling unless you go too. I need my support team. Hello, welcome to Tweak Coffee. What can I interest you in today? What's this? Relationship counseling? Craig? Are you shitting me? Well, fine, I'll do it. As long as you're there. You seem to be able to get him to think rationally. Okay, at least I'm liked by both sides, so I can tell them both to get over their problems and get back together. It sure I don't even know what... Th they broke up because of this whole super out. thing. So... Uh, I don't know. Let's just, let's just finish up my character sheet. I'm sick of this. Let's see. 
there's a microbrewery. You'll find a person inside who can assist you with race. Good luck. Okay, race. This is gonna be interesting. Um, can't go in that way. I think. Um, where's the door? Now, who can teach me about race? Wait a minute. It. I. I wonder. Is it? And now you got a oh my God! It's PC principal. I'm not just gonna sit here and do nothing while you insult this man's ethnicity. I wasn't insulting him. Excuse me. Did you or did you not say that this man seemed tired? Yes, he's my friend. I said, Paolo, you look tired. Microaggression! Ah, ah, ah. Persons of Hispanic backgrounds have been stereotyped as being sleepy and saying they look tired is a microaggression that will not stand. But I am tired. Oh, oh, ah. You! You're the new kid, right? I'm the principal of your school. My name is PC Principal. I was told you wanted to talk to me about some race issues. Okay. To an extent, I actually do not like PC Principal because, you know, he's kind of an ass. I mean, yeah, I get it. He has a good idea, good morals or whatever, but he's kind of an ass. Let's see. Come on, you want to learn about race, right? Give me your best shot. It's a nice day, isn't it? Okay. What's wrong with you? You can't just attack for no reason. Try again. Seriously? It's a nice day, isn't it? Mm, yes, very good. That was indeed not a microaggression. All right, round two. I ate a hamburger last week. <laughs> no! Oh, come on. For social justice, you have to learn to identify microaggressions. Dude, it's hard to identify microaggressions because they're so fucking subtle. And you will see how it gives you a free shot. Okay. All right, everybody, listen up. I'm about to use a microaggression, but it's only for the use of training this young person. In the ways of the social justice warrior. Look, dude, Thank no you. one Michael gives Griffin. a shit. Thank you. My friend Brian looks like a chick. Microaggression. Hit him. Oh, oh. Oh. Not bad, kid. Not bad at all. Not only is the word chick derogatory to females, but also criticizing a male for looking feminine is a microaggression towards person of transgender. Now let's see if you can spot a microaggression that's more subtle. Okay. My pants are warm. My pants are warm. Maybe. Wrong! My pants are warm is not a microaggression! No, you're agreeing aggressive against people who have cold pants. That coffee belongs to Tim Sherman. What's wrong with you? You can't just attack for no reason. Try again! Oh my god, I am terrible at this. That coffee belongs to Tim Sherman. No, it doesn't. Fuck you. I heard it's going to rain. Janet likes to roller skate. Ugh. Mr. Yamashiro is actually a very good driver. Oh, that's a microaggression. microaggression. Hit oh, they'll just tell me. Cool. Nice kid, very nice indeed. Using the term actually inferred that maybe other Asian Americans are not good drivers. And the use of Mr. is offensive to persons of third gender. Now before we talk about your race, I need you to get out there and do some PC work for me. I'll let you know when I think you're ready. Oh, so I actually have to... Find microaggressions. They're probably gonna be, uh, unless they're gonna be very common, they're probably just gonna be randomly fucking generated. People use microaggressions Great. every day. I'm okay. On you to make them pay for okay. I'll, I'll let you know how that goes. My lord, I have to say I'm mildly impressed with the progress you're making. Come to the coon lair. I've got a little surprise for you. Kuna. Oh, cool. I wonder what surprise they have for me. Better be good. Swear to God, if it's something shitty. Okay. Hopefully it's something good. Oh, they changed the password. Okay. Get scramble fast. All right. No, 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 no. We can't do the Super Craig movie before the Human Kite Netflix series, guys. That doesn't make any sense. Well, what about introducing Super Craig in the second Coon and Friends movie? That'd be pretty DC Comics of us. I wouldn't recommend it. Ah, Butt Lord, please have a seat. Sorry, guys. Can I have a moment with Butt Lord, please? Sure thing. Come on, Fast Pass. Uh... Right behind you, Mosquito. <laughs> Butt Lord, I just wanted to let you know that we've decided to let you have your own Netflix series right after the Fast Pass Fox miniseries and the third Coon and Friends United movie. Congratulations. Oh, cool. Can we call it Butt Lord okay, Unleashed? Well, get out there and finish your goals. Just uh, wanted to tell you the exciting news. What do you want, new kid? I already let you dual class. There's nothing left to talk about. 
Oh no, 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 you are not going to have three classes. New kid, new kid, no, do not give me those sad puppy eyes. Nobody gets to be three classes. It, you think that just because you had to live through your dad fucking your mom, you should get all the sympathy in the world, don't you? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to bring that up. All right, all right, fine. If you were going to add another class, Look, what would it be? I deserve this. Assassin. Ooh, assassin. Oh my god, I already know I'm going to pick assassin. I just want to look at the other ones. So I'll be a high-speed, super-punching assassin. Not sure if you're cool enough, but whatever. I'm not going to dress up like Catwoman, though, because that shows off too much of my man boobs. A gadgeteer, fighting crime with no real superpowers. Ooh, that just looks weird. Assassin. Assassin, hope you're not squeamish about blood. Boring people to death is not a legit- So yeah, what an amazing moment for you. You must be excited. Blaster. Elementalist. Cyborg. Psychic. Gadgeteer. An assassin. Not sure if you're cool enough, but whatever. Okay, but if you're gonna be triple class, then we have to change your backstory. It is All right, really let's, uh, let's revent my story again, again, I guess. Back to when you were just a child. You couldn't sleep that night, but it was because you saw strange lights in the sky. You walked to the mirror. And the lag is still the terrible with the backstory. Kid, maybe wasn't from this world. And that's when you heard it. Strange alien sounds from the hallway. I, I don't know if the alien thing really works with either assassin or gadgetry or... And, and an oh god, it's an alien. And this. But you know what? So you I'm an assassin. So fuck you. Though that's not really superpower. An I've just been you super trained. You prepared to do what you do best. Kill. Wasting no time. You drew first blood with a quick cut attack on the now, nearest Now, I shiv you. That's not a power. That's me literally pulling out a knife and stabbing the fuck out Bloody of him. Your target called for his companions to aid him. Hey, that kid has a knife. Oh shit! Seriously? Even as he lost blood, the intruder swung his crowbar wildly at your face. <laughs> you needed to get out of the fray and back into the shadows. Get back into the shadows now, okay? Hmm, not bad. Hey, where'd that little shit go? Bewildered, the villain searched for any trace of your whereabouts. I got a bad feeling about this. Ugh. You stealthily crept into Aha, the because I'm invisible, you cannot see me. But now, the let me. Oh my god, that ability is awesome. I'm so switching abilities with that one. That is so this replacing is my, my fart ability. Invader. Mortally wounded, the last standing foe charged at you and let loose a blood fueled onslaught. Wait, he does what? Oh god. I'll have to do my ultimate. He was do or die. You were him. Oh my god! It's fucking Assassin's Creed! Oh my god, that is that is awesome! Oh my god. Okay, I, I think I think this game has the option if you have if you go through the Ubi store and use points from achievements which I've gotten, I can get the Assassin's Creed armor. And if I can, I am so switching to that and I'm keeping that because that is awesome. A high speed, hard hitting assassin in Assassin's Creed armor. I love it. 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 You still have a lot of things to do. Oh my god. Oh my god. And I was able to find it too. Uh -huh. sure I have no idea why we're here. Yeah, oh, Freedom Pals, cool. Yeah, but why would the Freedom Pals want to talk to I don't us? recall getting a message. I just kind of came across crap. this by chance. Relax, coon friends. I didn't come to fight. Hello, Toolshed. Oh, cool, Stan. Long time no see. Toolshed is a gadgeteer class visionary archetype and a butt fucking traitor. Just listen to me. I understand that the new kid helped take my dad's keys last night. 
New kid, I don't know why you were looking out for my dad, but I owe you one. That's all I can It was say. literally pure you might chance. Be in the wrong franchise, but if you ever need help, I'll return the favor. <laughs> oh, oh, you think the new kid fucking cares about you? You belong to a loser zero income franchise that's run by a douchebag in a wheelchair. At least he's not a fat little phone stealer. Oh, not him again. Timmy! You call us losers when the only way you can get a lead is to steal it? Where is Dr. Timothy's phone? Sorry, freedom pussies. That info is classified. <laughs> you guys need to stop investigating the Chamber of Commerce and leave it to the professional superheroes. Oh yeah, you guys are the professional superheroes. It just so happens, Mysterion, that we already have a connection with Netflix. No, you don't. Yes, we do. We're just about to get the Human Kite Netflix series off the ground, so... No, Timmy, no. Oh, God. No. Mind rape. Stop. Stop. Stop it, Timmy. He's trying to rape my mind. Ah! Ah! They don't have a connection at Netflix. Freedom Pals just raped my mind, you guys. Let's get these pedophiles. Coon and friends assemble. Freedom Pals, unite. Civil War II, it's going down. You're outmatched. Give up before you embarrass yourselves. Okay, so we're fighting the Freedom Pals again. Time to use another summons I got. Oh, no. Got this off screen when I found Kyle's dad high off his ass on cheese. Just to clarify, if you guys don't know what cheese is, it's uh, slang for essentially this type of cat urine. <laughs> Didn't do a lot of damage, but did something. And where did Dr. Timmy go? Oh, he can teleport. Fucking asshole. I have a really good feeling about this, guys. How would you like a screwdriver sandwich, coon? You wield those tools like a surgeon. Here comes the cavalry. Feel the wrath of human kite. Fighting Dr. Timothy is a mistake beyond your comprehension. Microaggression. Hit him. Formidable as always, Mysterion. Timmy! I'm about to bring it. <laughs> Aren't you just full of surprises, Tupperware? And perhaps a few oh, left. Oh, fuck. And I actually like the mental voice they gave Timmy. It actually, it's, it's interesting. Though, actually, because of how fucked up all this is, I like how I do like how this is like a DC versus Marvel thing. And also I'm not sure Timmy would actually be in favor of brainwashing a bunch of kindergartners, but you know what? I I'll live. Like I'll live. I can live with that. This might sting. That was pretty cool, Coon. I couldn't even see the wires. Fuck you, dude. I don't use wires. Time to show off my tool set. Oh. Not bad. You're up, ass blaster. That was a thorough fisting. Watch me, watch me. I'm gonna do something. Watch me. Yo! Oh. <laughs> you look stupid. Attack plan, Delta Gamma. Leaner fart. I don't want to play anyway. Timmy! Forecast is blustery with a big chance of Wrath of Kite. I like our odds. You're outmatched. Give up before you embarrass yourselves. Uh -uh. 
I'd call that an appropriate application of force. Impressive, Tupperware. Most impressive. I'm all revved up and ready. <laughs> Cooning friends forever! It's finally my turn. Oh, thank God. Yeah. Now go tell everyone you cut yourself manscaping. I'm ready to break out the heavy equipment, guys. Oh, oh. Every tool has its place in the fight for freedom. Congrats, super friends. Okay, we're almost good. If I could just defeat Dr. Timmy with my assassin. I love how assassin I can hit you from anywhere. Oh, fuck. That, that is awesome. That is a screenshot if I ever knew one. You can't, don't let you are out. You. All that's left now is Mysterion. I honestly thought the little kindergartners would, you know, be free of Dr. Timothy's control, but, uh, yeah. Whatever, I'm invisible now. Oh, I'm up? Okay. Keep He's out. Make way for Mysterion! Uh, I'm gonna roast you for that. Everyone try to keep up. Healing and point three. And boom. Give Kuhn a little health. Sweet, thanks. Time to spread some rabies. Guess I'll let Kuhn finish him. You know, I could have done it with my blades of glory, but fuck it. I'm not gonna be an ass. Oh, not bad. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that is twice we kicked your asses. You guys are nothing without the new kid, and you know it. New kid, my offer stands. I still owe you one. And if you ever want to be part of a real franchise, just call me. Yeah, right. You guys are GC Comics. We're Marvel. Fucking asshole, you guys have Zack Snyder direct your fucking movies. Hey, that was some pretty good PC police work, kid. Way to take advantage of those motherfuckers. Oh, yeah, because I was able to do the microaggression. Okay, the sounds good. Now. You have potential, kid. I'm glad to have you in town. Now let's discuss your race and ethnicity. Let's determine exactly what you are. Oh my god, there are so many different... Um, white? yeah, she's gonna be white, and... Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, this is hilarious. Oh, there's just so many I want to be. Just be American. Just easier. American. Race and ethnicity are very different things. I'm not going to identify but as a different skin tone. I, I've kind of always found that to be kind of asinine. You know, identifying with an a, with a with an abstract concept, just gender, or See, even to an extent, way. what nationality. You but you can't hide your skin color. You are what your you are what the colored pigments in your cells in your skin cells are. There's no escaping that. Darn it! I don't think that vigilante setting a good example. Okay. Attention all Coon friends. We have the information we need and are ready for our next mission. Everyone report to the Coon Lair immediately. To the Coon Lair. Get. Scrambles. Fast. Captain Diabetes is blowing up on social media. 
There you are. Jesus, took you long enough. Have a seat, Butt Lord. All right, everyone. Butt Lord interrogated Classy and found out our next lead is at the U store it here in town. We need to infiltrate it tonight. It can't be done. Why not, Mosquito? Because the U store entrance is all lava. The whole thing is fucking lava? Shit! There has to be a way to get past it. There is. Tool shed. Tool shed? What's that donkey fucker have to do with anything? Toolshed has a device that clears lava, remember? It's one of his superpowers. Hey, and Toolshed said that he owes the new kid a favor. So you want me to take advantage well, of Toolshed's like uh, favor and, and make him Lord. get rid of the Super lava Craig, for us? Write an anonymous email to Toolshed. Tell him the new kid is ready to have his favor returned. Everyone else, go home and get in bed. We meet at the U store at tonight. Too bad, everybody. <laughs> Coon friends are on the case. Go on home, Butt Lord. If all goes according to plan, Toolshed will meet up with you later. Just be careful. Toolshed is a two-faced, backstabbing butt sniffer. Okay, let's just uh, change the costume. At least with my speed, I quickly shift in and out of my assassin clothing. Okay, so not bad for day two. I'm still curious how far this will go since the use store. If I remember from Stick of Truth, um, Butters or Doctor or Professor Chaos had that, and from the looks of it, and what? No, no argument. I'm just gonna have to sit there and depressingly eat my food. God, these are like the worst parents ever. But yeah, that means I'm probably dealing with Professor Chaos since he seems to be responsible for the lava. So if there's lava, it's gonna be him. All right, let's see if my parents are arguing. Why oh, yep, they are. Why would you tell the school principal what race we are? I didn't tell him. Our child did. But you confirmed it when the principal called you. How long before they find out everything? Our little boy is hurting. Don't you get it? He's asking questions about his race and sexual orientation because he's confused. Confusion was the point. The more our child learns about the truth, the more dangerous it becomes, you stupid whore. Now, hey, look yeah, here. I kind of hear everything. Play, and now I don't even care if people fight. I kind of want to know some more of this yes, truth you're hiding tomorrow. from me. Since I already know the truth. Like, seriously, why are you pretending like I don't know? Are we trying to make stick of truth, like, as if it never happened? Whatever's in these things are making you crazy! Crazy? Like telling the world who our child is that we took so long to hide? Oh, are you not gonna drink? God, what is wrong with you? Oh well. Thank you so much for watching. Share, subscribe, let me know what you think, comment below, and I will get back to you in the next video. Thank you and goodbye.